Since many of your operations might be similar, you might make good use of this source template selection here. So we're going to click on the select button here and we're going to pick one of the ones to use as a basis of our new study. So I'm going to pick the sample pick and pack here and I just say use it down at the bottom here. It takes me back to the screen and you can see my source template is going to be this one here. So if I wanted to give it a new name instead of the study one at the top here, I would come down into the rename template field and I might say pick two. And then I do an update over here. I touch the update button and my study is now called pick two. I can get rid of the keyboard by tapping on the button down here and then I can go direct to the elements here and it will bring up all of the elements in the study and let me edit them here. So many times you may well just select an existing study, bring it up and then start making edits here. And of course here you can add, edit, delete, move up, move down, move left and right. These will all be explained in a separate video here to you. So what we've shown you here how you can use the select button to make a selection of an existing template to use as a basis for your new study.